Hi, my name is Summer, and welcome to Ancient Historic News. Today, we're going to be here with one and only Grace. She survived around, being around the plague her whole life. Bonjour! So, what was it like growing up around the plague? It was utterly repulsive. There were rats and rats and death. Everywhere, people lying down on the ground, it was just oh, and oh, oh, oh. What did the plague look like exactly? It was a revolting, repulsive German. You'd get these black lumps the size of a cricket ball that would burst, and you'd get you'd throw up blood, and you'd get really weak muscles, and you'd die. Were they doctored at that time? They were. They were scary. Very scary. They wore these leather masks that were a bit like a bird. And they couldn't be burnt. Some people thought that the doctors stuffed the beak of the bird with flowers and smoke so that they couldn't smell the plague. Where did the plague exactly come from? We're not sure where it came from, but it definitely was from the rats. We don't know where the rats got it. The rats got bitten by the fleas, and if the flea bit you, you'd die within five days. Where did they put the dead bodies? That's a bit of a strange question. There wasn't enough room to bury 7,560 people in one week, so... There was a guy, he would get all the dead bodies and send them to the city. And the city people would put them on a boat and the boat would go to this little island off of Italy where they put all the plagued bodies. I believe now there's an insane asylum and a war practice ground there. Has there been any like calls about it today? Um, not very many. There's usually about... 1,000 to 2,000 cases a year, and I believe you could get cured and survive nowadays. When was the outbreak? Well, there was an outbreak from 1375 to 1376 when I wasn't alive, but the one when I was alive was from 1662 to 1664. Very hard to remember as I'm over 4,000 years old. Was there different types of plague or is it just the one? There were three different types of plagues. They were not very good. The first was bubonic plague, which had all the symptoms I've told you about. And then the next was pneumonic plague, which could also give you brain damage. And the last was spectimic, spectimic, very hard to pronounce, plague, which would fill up your lungs with some kind of fluid and you'd basically drown from the inside. Do you know if there's any cure today? No, I'm not sure if there's any cure today, but some people have survived it. How long does it last for? Generally it lasted for five days once you first showed symptoms, but you could be carrying it for over a month. Read it here from Grace. <gasps> oh! You heard it here from Grace. Ah! Oh! Oh! R.I.P. Grace. But um, that's it for Ancient Historic News. You heard it her. <laughs>